Kirsten Rosa worked his way up through the Rockets' ranks. He's now the president of basketball for the T-Wolves. David Nuno had him on the No Layups podcast and reports the NBA is getting closer to returning. The Rockets will open up their practice facility tomorrow. Some NBA teams have already opened up, while some will still do it down the line. Minnesota President of Basketball Ops, Gerson Rosas, is cautiously optimistic for the return of hoops. Every market, every team is kind of taking their own route. Uh, we've been very sensitive to make sure that markets are safe and that we're not putting our players or our staff in danger. Uh, but it's, you know, there's traction now, and I think people are working together. Uh, I think the more educated we are on, on this situation and how we can protect each other through this process gives us more confidence. Uh, Europe, Germany, uh, those individuals went through this a little bit earlier than us, so they've got some guidance. Rosas recognizes teams that get an early start could get a competitive advantage, but that's not the entire story. You move too fast, you move too soon, you try to do too much, uh, that competitive advantage might become a disadvantage. and. That's what organizations are trying to start at trying to stay away from. And it, it's just real. Every situation is different. Every market's different. Now, Rosas has worn many hats in his NBA career. 17 years with the Rockets, a U of H grad, and lots of perseverance. A lot of individuals like Rudy T and Carol Dawson and Dennis and uh, Daryl and uh, a handful of coaches that I'm very fortunate to call friends uh, to this very day helped me learn the game, uh, helped me understand the league, and really invested a lot in me. David Nuno, ABC 13, Eyewitness Sports. All right, the last day.